Hi everyone, today I'm starting shooting a video about how I'm going to make my first big artwork. It's gonna be in Crimea, I'm living there now, it's half past 10, I'm moving out from Moscow. Road to Rostov will take 11 hours today and another 11 hours to Alushta tomorrow, where the Morris Spa Hotel that invited me to make two artworks is located. Аграрные же общество почему реализовано именно на очень важная подробность. I'm here. This is Crimea, Moria Spa Hotel in Alushta. Today I will meet the hotel managers to discuss the details and they see outside the window. There is a month of work ahead and I'm looking forward to an awesome results. The concept of this project is to make both artworks using only materials that can be found on the hotel property. It is uh, upcycling, which is basically using garbage, so now I am looking for metal for the sculpture's frame. Let me tell you a little more. I am worried about the problem of single-use plastic and once I made a concept of an artwork made from plastic bottles. This concept was noticed by people from the Mori Spa Hotel, who are also care about recycling and reusing. So they invited me to implement this artwork. Okay, the main material for my future artwork are plastic bottles. The hotel releases about 700 bottles every day when the hotel is fully booked. This is an absolutely insane amount, so I need to use them and now I have to come up with what to do with them. So, another small problem was discovered. After removing the sticker, sticky residue remains on the bottle which will have to be removed, and this requires some kind of solvent, and this is an additional move. And considering that I will have an about 800 bottles, this is about 800 additional moves. What does a normal person's bathroom look like? Since there will be a lots of bottles, I decided to collect some auxiliary element, which will help me cut these bottles easier and faster. I literally found some pieces of wood in the garbage and want to build a gadget from them. So, this is not a very tricky gadget I came up with. This is what the table looks in my room. Today is the fourth day and finally metal works has begun. We moved to a tunnel area in the back of the building. It is cold and windy here, but at least we are working. The men are welding, bending, everything is awesome. Sometimes I ask myself, why do I create all these difficulties? Then I struggle with them. What for? 
On the other hand, probably nothing really good can come out without these struggles. One of the greatest parts of this process is bottle washing. This is what I am going to do tonight. Okay, a small update. Today is the sixth day of all this entertainment. Welding is happening. The welders work there. I am working on the bottles. There is an incredible amount of bottles. My room is filled with bags. Each bag contains a hundred plastic bottles. And sometimes I think that I somehow went too far with the size of this sculpture because there should be 1740 bottles half and each bottle must be washed the glue must be removed from each bottle with gasoline then cut in two then holes must be made that's terrible but at least the view is great and there is a hope it will turn out cool so i keep working We have a small problem. The welder had to leave. As a result, I had to master a new profession. Now I'm a welder myself. Yesterday we started welding the frame, so we continue today and after that we will go directly to the bottles. Update on work. I've been here for the month. We've almost finished welding the frame for the bottle sculpture. There are 11 guides left and then everything should be painted and I can proceed to the bottles. The next last step began, attaching the bottles to the frame. The frame is ready, it was transported to a room suited for work. The sea is right there. There is Nastya, tormenting the cat. Well, now we are beginning to attach the bottles. 106,000 bottles to go, then painting and the artwork is be ready.
Now I sit and think that the most beautiful thing in the job that I've devoted 20 years of my life, and this is architecture, the most beautiful thing about it is that you come up with something in your head and then after a while it is built in a large scale as you intended. And this is the coolest feelings ever. And what I'm doing now is even better, as not only do I do everything myself, I can also come up with something that no one else has done before and build it myself on a large scale and people will come to see it. And this path from a thought that accidentally appeared in my head to something tangible, unusual, this is the biggest thrill. Today is officially a month that I have been in this hotel and now I am attaching halves of plastic bottles to the metal frame and it is so boring and monotonous that I am starting having philosophical thoughts. And this fire alarm is constantly beeping and it's annoying. So the last part is painting. Here we brought both halves of sculpture to the site where we can paint it. The sculpture didn't fit into the van, the bottles got crumpled, but it's okay. I will start painting now. Thank you. 